Wait a minute, we got a candle down. We got a candle down. All right, let me set the candle up here. Hold on. Those are pretty awesome candles right there, by the way. I hear you, sir. I know you're getting ready to jump at me again. Or are you still, okay, he was still on his way back down. He must be on, oh, there you go. <laughs> Guys, right now I am standing in front of East High where Troy Bolton went love crazy and all his friends had to remind him to get you, get you, get you, get you, get your head in the game. But that's not what we're here for today. We are here to get our game on at this Spirit Halloween right here in Salt Lake City, Utah. That's right, my friends, home of Troy Bolton and the Wildcats. If Troy and Gabriella were searching for a couple's costume for the Halloween dance, what would they choose? You tell me in the comments below. I don't know what this building used to be, but I think it's funny how right underneath the sign it says since 1955. That's not too far off. The first Spirit Halloween was actually opened in 1980. 83. What the heck? Whoa. This is a pretty cool looking place. Look, this apparently used to be a natural grocer's. I'm loving the orange in here. It goes right along with Spirit Halloween. Okay, let's go ahead in, guys, and see what they have in Salt Lake City, Utah. I am already loving this store, guys. Especially because, look at this. You can still see all the signs from when it was a natural grocer's. And look up here, it looks like such a fall design all across there. It's funny because with this area up here, this is very reminiscent of the stores that I've been in that used to be a gym. And I love when things just catch my eye right in the door, even though I've seen them a million times. This shirt right here, I absolutely love. Michael Myers, let's get a close up up here. Get in, loser. We're going slashing. <laughs> All right. Somebody else, speaking of the shirts, was asking me to look at the Terrifier shirt. That is actually a pretty dang cool design right there. I don't know if there was a specific question about that shirt, but there it is. Get a good close look, and then we are going to take a walk around the entire store here, guys, and see what kind of awesomeness they have in here. See if there's anything different that we haven't seen in other stores. I just, I gotta say, guys, I absolutely love the layout of this store. I love how you can just stand here and look all the way down and you can see where there's different ways you can go throughout. But before we do that, let's say hello to our friends, starting with the Martian Warrior. Hello, Martian Warrior. Wow, he is super loud in here. <laughs> Check out the big brain on Brad. All right, let's go on over here and see who else we have on the outside. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this. It is the first store that I have been in this entire season that actually has heckles set up. And here's the funny thing. This is the old heckles. This is the old heckles with the face that's kind of messed up, I think. I'm pretty sure that's the old face because his old face, the chin and like this area in here, it's just a little saggier or something. Anyways, okay, let's go ahead and get Heckles moving here. I can think of starting my own carnival right here. You want to join my clown troupe? You have a pretty funny face. <laughs> you have a pretty funny face, he said. Okay, I don't know, the balloon, it must be turned backwards or something because I can't see the face. Nothing like a good carnival to really lift your spirits, right? <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Okay, you can't even hear him, guys, because it's just so, so quiet. He needs to be turned up a lot. But anyways, yeah, how cool is that? First store I've been in this season where they actually had a heckle set up. And you guys tell me, is that the old face or is it the new face? I am pretty dang sure it's the old face. We got a couple stacks of animatronics I'm seeing. We're going to check those out in just a minute here. But first, let's say hello to Slim. Wow, these... um. Step pads are like way up in here. All right, let's put a sticker in his popcorn bag there. We'll leave a couple here for heckles. We got the widow over here. We can't go around without saying hello to the widow. 
And let's go into the chamber of death, past the spooky candles of death, and the fabric of death, and the fire of death, and let's say hello to Dagger Mike. <laughs> I think that looks so cool right there, guys, with the fire on each sides and his arms spread out. Let's say hello to Grim and the scary sitting scarecrow. There you go. We'll leave you some stickers, sir. Okay, before we move on, let's look at what we have over here on the floor, guys. We have a The Widow. We have a man's possessed friend, but the box is actually turned around backwards. We have two little skelly bones. We have one, two little Jack Carvers, and we have an eternal rest on the bottom. I was just looking at little Jack Carver thinking, man, should I buy him today? But I already bought him. I actually have him in the trunk. I kidnapped little Jack Carver. Okay, let's keep moving back here because I see more animatronics back here. Whoa, oh my gosh, guys, look. I don't think I've seen this one. The Corpse Bride Lounge Fly Backpack. This is pretty awesome, too. All of these are. I love these things so much. Here's the Michael Myers, and here's the uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. That is an awesome one right there. We got Chucky down here. We got another Nightmare Before Christmas here that's shaped like a coffin. I don't know what the heck this one is. And then we have this Fall Guys backpack here, which is equally as awesome, but it's not the same type. All right, let's keep moving here. Here we go, guys. We have two Bubba's Man's Possessed Friend right here, and we can see the front of the box this time. We have a scary sitting scarecrow up here, a regular sitting scarecrow down here. We have, let's see, the 55-inch floor candelabra, and another scary sitting scarecrow there. Oh my gosh, guys, look how stuck this entire wall here is the entire store is like just standing here and looking around this area you can see how stocked the entire store is what the heck and look at how many side steppers they have here holy crap guys all right we have the chucky side stepper we have the sam oh he has his tag on but we have the sam side stepper we have the leather face we have Lydia down here. Here's a Sam I think we can get going. Yes, there they go, in unison. We have the Pennywise. Aw, wait a minute. Pennywise batteries must be dead. Holy crap, they all got super loud all of a sudden. We have Frankenstein down here. We have Ghostface. We have uh, Spiky here. And then, yeah, Chucky, Ghostface, and Leatherface on the bottom there. How cool. They have a ton of those. Oh, and they even have Billy Butcherson back here, too. I think I actually have two Billy Butcherson sidesteppers. I think I bought one, and then somebody sent me one in a fan mail Friday. And don't forget about this sale, guys. Mix and match. Buy one, get one 50% off. I don't know if they just started that or what, but this is the second store I've been in where they had that posted. And that goes for Hocus Pocus, Nightmare Before Christmas, Haunted Mansion, and Beetlejuice. Wait a minute, here's a fleece throw I have not seen. Look at this, talk to the dead. <laughs> Clairvoyance for beginners. That is creepy. I was just about to say that guy looks like the guy from Poltergeist 2. And look at this. This is a Poltergeist 2 blanket. How cool is that? I love that. See, a lot of people tell me that like, what do you, what's the big deal? It's the same store over and over, but it's not. I always find things in different stores that I have not seen yet. I think we've seen all the rest of these blankets here. Look at all this plush and all these pillows just jammed in here. And I don't know if I've seen this one before from Killer Clowns from Outer Space, the Big Top Burger Pillow. That is cool. And I love how there's just a random skeleton arm hanging out there. And all these pictures here, I'm not sure if I've seen all of these. Like, there's so many things in these stores that it's easy to miss stuff. Wait a minute, look at this. From Halloween, time to slay, time to play. Can you guys see that change? 
That is an awesome picture. I've never seen that one before. Exactly what I'm talking about, guys. Go to different stores and you'll find different stuff. I don't think I've seen this one before either. The Texas Chainsaw Massacre plaque here. Look, they even have the van down there. That's awesome. Plenty of jumping spiders here. I see some more animatronics back here. Whoa, look at this. There's a whole bunch of them. Oh my God. <laughs> and I just heard Desmodus jump as well as Gordo, and they both jumped at the same time to scare the living crap out of me. <laughs> Wait a minute, we got a candle down. We got a candle down. All right, let me set the candle up here. Hold on. Those are pretty awesome candles right there, by the way. I hear you, sir. I know you're getting ready to jump at me again. Or are you still, okay, he was still on his way back down. He must be on, oh, there you go. <laughs> I was just about to say he must be on the sensor. Oh my gosh, guys, there's so many sounds going on here right now. We got the eternal rest down here, spinning the head like crazy. I hear you, sir, ma'am. We have Gordo over here on a repeated jumping schedule. Come on, Gordo, there we go. <laughs> All right, the only one that's not like jumping constantly is uh, Darling Dolly here. Let's see if we can get her going. All right, Dolly, here we go. Wow, this is a tight spot here, too. She's going to be close. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> she is so loud. Look how far her neck sticks out. And look at this little area where I was standing. She was, like, right up in my face. I can hear the howling spirit over here going ballistic, too. And then, of course, we have this guy, the Hexpawn. Come on, Hexpawn. Here we go. Ay! Hex fun is like one of the best guys. I love how fast he jumps up. Howling Spirit appears to have a broken arm over here. I see the black heart moving, but I can't hear a word he's saying because everything else is making so much noise in here. I love it. I love it. All right, we'll leave a couple stickers here. Hello to the Grave Watcher. Hello to Lil Skelly Bones. Hello once again to Desmodus, who's going ballistic. I think we should call him the Ballistic Bat from now on. <laughs> Do you like that, sir? The ballistic bat. And last but not least, we have the jumping spider. Hello, sir. One sticker for you. All right, let's make our way over here to this stack of animatronics. Hello, rat. Hello, cat. Hello, best friends for life. And hello, secret keeping cat. What kind of secrets are you keeping today? Let's put some stickers in the cauldrons here. A sticker for the monkey. All right, back to the animatronics, I promise this time. Okay, we have Slim here. We have a leather face right here. We have a fogging scar pile on top. We have these Huntleys over here, which somebody told me they are actually pretty awesome. I don't know if I'm sold on them yet, like if I actually want to buy one yet, but it does look pretty cool, especially the skull. Singing, talking, and joking, built-in speaker, 60 minutes of fun animations. All right, anyway, life-size posable skeletons. We have fogging skull piles down here. We have the leather face statue right here, which is totally awesome. We have the straw man on top. We have a couple of stilts here, AKA Papa pins. In fact, it looks like we have three of them. We have the hex spawn and poor George. Oh look, here's a poor George setup right here. Excuse me, sir, what are you doing here? Oh just hanging around. We have a Heckles. If you want Heckles, get down to Salt Lake City, Utah. Scary sitting scarecrow. It looks like we have two black hearts here. We have a young Crouchy hiding back here. Hmm. We have a widow down here for 149. The sign. Oh, okay. Let's see. Reason it's reduced. The neck motion and sound no longer sync up. Whoa. Look at this, guys. An Emmeline, which is reduced because she does not work. I wonder what the extent of does not work means. $139, guys. That is half price for that prop. Honestly, if I had room in the car for her, I'd buy her right now and I'd get a hold of the zombie squad. But I don't, so I'm gonna have to leave her right here in Salt Lake City, Utah. And here's a jumping spider, which is also reduced for $25 because he apparently does not work either. But we still have a whole side of animatronics here that do work. We have two howling spirits. We have a sitting, a scary, 
sitting scarecrow, a straw man, another straw man. We have a man's possessed friend here. Look, we have a cauldron of skies. How cool is that? And we have four of these Jabber and Jack animated pumpkins. Now, these are cool. 70 minutes of talking, singing, and joking. And the faces, like, just appear on these pumpkins. How much is this guy? Uh, thirty-four ninety-nine. I think that's what that says. Is that thirty-four? Yeah, I had to look on another one to make sure because that one's not really clear. Thirty-four ninety-nine for these. This guy is totally cool. I have seen videos online of these working, and they are awesome. I love these. Wait, do they make sound? 70 minutes of custom animations. Spooky, funny, and traditional animated pumpkin faces. And over here it says built-in speaker brings Jack to life with vocals and music. So I think... I think they actually make sounds, or do you have to add your own sounds? I might buy one today and I'll have to find out. Oh my gosh, guys, I just can't get over how absolutely stocked they are with everything in here. Just about anything you want from Spirit Halloween, it looks like they have it in this store, including milk, yogurt, butter, and refrigerated foods. <laughs> And let's not forget about these pea friends going sledding. What do you think about that, sir? Uh... All right, let's journey over to the mask section here for a minute because they're so stocked in here. We are almost bound to see a mask or two that we have not seen in other stores. Here's a glow-in-the-dark skull mask. I don't know if we've seen this one in other stores. Look at the jaw on that thing. That's kind of strange. And here's an even stranger thing, guys. Some masks smell like vanilla. And standing right here, I am overcome with the smell of vanilla. I'm such a nerd. I'm standing here smelling the mask. And guys, it's this one. It's usually just like the Fun World masks. And this does not say it's from Fun World, but this thing smells like an entire bottle of vanilla. <laughs> they do have the hot nozzles mask here. I don't know if I've seen that in other stores this season. Oh, they have the evil corn mask down here. And speaking of corn, this looks like a weapon they would use on children of the corn. I don't think there's anything else in the mask section that we haven't seen. Let's go on over here and see what kind of zombie babies they have. Holy crap, guys. I just Like I said, I just can't get over how absolutely stocked they are in this store. We have the ghost face and and the Sam. I do not see Leatherface or Pennywise, but I do see this brain-eating baby right here. Mm -hmm. Let's see if they have Glenn. They have Sitting Sam dolls. They have Annabelle. They have Chucky. But I do not see Glenn anywhere. Hello, Swinging Wit. Oh my gosh, guys, look at what a tight squeeze it is to go through this aisle here because they are so stocked. Stocked with bad breath, stocked with hook eye guys, stocked with double head freds, stocked with hook head hogs, and stocked with ham hocks! Stocked with hand eating babies, and rat eating babies, and breakdancing babies, <laughs> moth-eating babies, pumpkin-eating babies, and singing babies. I know, that was a funny one, right? Sticker for the babies, sticker for the babies, sticker for the babies. Wow, guys. All right, I think I'm gonna call it a day in here. I've been in here so long messing around and having fun, but I think I'm gonna get that singing pumpkin if I can figure out where the heck I saw it. I think, oh, it's over here. Okay, let's go get it. I really want to get Emmeline, but she'll have to wait for another day. Today, we are going to get a Jabberin' Jack. All right, guys, make sure that you subscribe and come back and keep watching because we have plenty more Spirit Halloween stores that we are going to this season. Music